bikini I own so that I can go through them and tell you all my favorites, my thoughts, the sizes I wear, and everything I recommend. Starting off with my credentials. Number one, I've lived my entire life in Florida, so swimsuits are just like what I wear on the daily. I swim every single day. All of my content revolves around swimming. I am always in a swimsuit, and I know what swimsuits I like. I know what swimsuits I can adventure in. I know what swimsuits look good on me, which is why I have a lot of thoughts and opinions on my favorite brands. Number two, I've been on social media now for a year, which is not very long at all. And in that time, I think I've been given like 80, 90 swimsuits, which is way more than the average person should ever own. It is not necessary. It is not needed. Think of it as my payment. I'm grateful to have it all. It is so unreasonable. Because of that, I've tried them all. I know the ones I love. So let's stop wasting time and let's get into it because we're starting off with triangle. Triangle I think of as my first love. A couple years ago when I decided to up my swimwear game and kind of invest more of my own money, triangle is the one that I wanted. I'm doing brand photography work and I literally said that if I get X amount of clients, my prize will be that I get to buy myself a triangle swimsuit. And I will actually show you which one that is. Starting off with one of my favorites is the bralette style and this is the exact swimsuit that I bought myself This lime green sparkly swimsuit. This is my favorite style top Which I have a ton of them in because while triangle swimsuits look cute their colors are amazing This top you could literally do anything in my go-to style to go adventuring in anytime I know I'm just gonna be like swimming for a long time or diving or throwing a wetsuit on I will always grab a triangle swimsuit for the bottoms I will always pick the normal cheeky style again I just think they're so flattering and look so good on everyone I can wear a small and triangle but I always pick a medium and that definitely is what fits best next style is very similar to the bra style but it's the style that has the dip in it. And it's definitely a more like feminine spin on the normal style. I'd say this is my second up adventure top. It's really flattering on, and it's probably honestly just a little bit more flattering than the other top, but I still love the other top more. We rinse off into our special styles of triangles, starting off with the one that is the most flattering of anything I've ever put on my body. This green one, besides the fact that it's an amazing color, just it looks good on. String tops and bottoms usually aren't my favorite, especially when they go around the neck. But this one I just think looks super flattering on and is so cute. And then I have the string bottoms that again are very flattering with this bandeau top. And the color is just beautiful, immaculate. And ending it off with, I have one triangle one piece and it's in the same color that reminds me of the one that I bought myself for the first time. So it was kind of special for me. And I just am a big one piece girl because I can wear them as an outfit and I can wear them as a swimsuit. Next up we have Kulani Kini, which is the one that I have by far the most of. After I got my triangle swimsuit, Kulani Kini was the next on my list for goals to get and gift myself. The style that made me obsessed was this green top. Again, I had a goal for myself and I really wanted this one. I saw it on Instagram on someone and that little ring in the middle was just so cute to me. And as you can probably see, I am now in love with that style. I have a million of them and they never get old to me. Third with my most frequently worn bottom as well, the retro Y bottom. I have a million of those too. And while they're probably a little too cheeky for a lot of people, they are an amazing tanning bottom. My second favorite style top from Kalani Kini is, I'm sure you can guess why, it's because it's an amazing adventure top. I think it's a good spin on the adventure top because in the back it has a little tie and it's super cute on. But I just love a top that just like feels secure and like it's not moving around. Paired with these bottoms that I usually probably wouldn't go for, but I love them. I wear a medium in all of Kalani Kini no matter what, except for these bottoms. <laughs> I ordered a medium in them once before and they were giant on me. So you can see I literally had my grandpa sew them a little smaller because I'm obsessed with the pattern. And from now on, I just always order a small in just these bottoms. Moving on to the underwire tops that Kalani Kini has. These are also one of my favorites. I have two versions of these that I have. One is that ruched version, which which I just think is so cute and girly and it has little charms on it. And then the standard one. If I'm not adventuring in a bralette, I feel like this is another good safe bet. Then we have a million of different variations of triangle tops. Typically, I am not a triangle top girl, but Kalani Kini does such a good job with the triangle tops because they're never like the tie around your neck. 
they're always just like the two straps going down which is the only reason I don't like triangle tops because normally it just hurts your neck to have it there all day and there are so many different versions that they have so many cute ones and then for the bottoms you will usually see a common theme Kuanakini just has a million types of bottoms so you can really have whatever you want with them for all though I love Kuanakini just because of the patterns they are just so so beautiful and gorgeous and whatever you want to find if you want to like feel different feel bright feel summery Kalanikini always has it. You will never go on there and be like, ugh, I can't find anything. While Kalanikini does amazing in everything, this one piece, I am a one piece girl. Some people don't like one pieces, I love them. This one piece is my favorite thing in the world. I have two one pieces from them, but this one is the one I wear the most often. Every single time I wear it, people ask where it's from, and it's from Kalanikini's, but they don't make it anymore, but they make this style. And the style is just so beautiful and perfect. I also have this other one piece, which is also super flattering. Anything they make will always be flattering on you. And then I just got this surf suit, which I am so excited to wear. I just tried it on and it looks amazing. I haven't worn it out yet, but I will report back the back though. So cute. Next up, we have the most buttery, softest, amazing swimsuits in the entire world, Sunbleach Swim. They are owned by the sweetest girl in the world, Heather. And truly, I have never seen anyone that cares more about quality and perfection, and it shows so much in these swimsuits. Number one, the colors are just gorgeous. Like, everything about the colors are gorgeous. I'm, I'm sure by now you already know my favorite style top is a little sports bra top, and I literally wear this to the ground. I pick this swimsuit every single time sometimes I have to limit myself there's so many different cute styles they're all so flattering however I think my favorite thing in the world is her one pieces she has made the best one piece to ever exist it's so flattering so comfortable I could literally wear it all day long I think they are worth every single cent and I literally do not have a bad thing to say about these swimsuits just look how cute all these colors go together and for Sunbleach swim I wear a medium in everything second on the buttery swimsuit train are Lenny swims the thing that gets me about these swimsuits is the patterns that she has so my strapless ones are reversible so cute. I love a good deal and that's a twofer. And then this swimsuit besides the beautiful beautiful pattern I feel like her patterns just stand out. It just fits so well and again it's so soft. I'm a sucker for a soft swimsuit and Sunbleach and Lenny just do it for me. In Lenny I wear a medium in all of her swimsuits. Following that we have Honey Swim that is owned by again the sweetest girls ever. Brindley and Mary Margaret own this, and if you don't know, I actually modeled in this swimwear line that they had just come out with, but I was a huge fan of their swimwear even before that. So it just helps that they're actually like the sweetest humans ever. My favorite is this ribbed pattern that they just came out with, and especially in the underwire style. Their bottoms are super, super good coverage. I know that is a goal of theirs, was to try to make like an in-between perfect coverage bottom, and they definitely did that in my opinion. Overall, I wear between sometimes a small, sometimes a medium. I'd probably do a medium to play it safe and everything, because personally, I just think there's nothing worse than a swimsuit being like too snug on me. And for any of these swimsuit lines that I have a code, I will definitely be putting it on the screen. I know for Honey Swim, I do have a code. But overall, I just think they do such an amazing job with their different patterns and they're always coming out with something new. They have a giant range of variety for just a small business that just started. And honestly, I feel like you have to find something you like on there. Elle Swims is a business for the people that love more coverage. This is one of their first styles they started out with and I remember seeing it on Instagram all the time, actually on Heather who owns Sunbleach Swim. And I was obsessed with this style. It had a whole cold on me. I thought it was so cute. And personally, my favorite are her one pieces. I think she does such an amazing job with the different patterns she has. But besides that, she makes the best high-rise swimsuit bottoms. They're not usually the bottoms that I go for, but just because I feel like it ruins my tan and that's just what I'm always thinking about. But they suck you in. So if that is your style, Elle Swims is the way to go. Next up, we have Dippin' Daisies. Dippin' Daisies has super cute patterns. I will say, I want to preface this because I want to be honest about my opinion on everything. They are a company that I find that their inner lining sometimes, you know, pokes out and that would be my only problem with them. My favorite thing of Dippin' Daisies is Olive Lynn did a collab with them, so it's on her website. I'll definitely have that linked below. And guys, the swimsuit she made with them 
I just never stop getting compliments on. They're like the perfect beachy cute patterns and I feel like they're so unique and different. And for Dippin' Daisies, I have a small in all of their swimsuits. Next up, I have City Beach Australia, which I love them. They have like a giant, giant, giant variety of brands and stuff on there. I have two of their brands that I think they make themselves. And these swimsuits are under their brand Kayami, I think is how you pronounce it, but I'm not sure. I'll put it up on the screen. And I just feel like if you search hard enough, they have like the best prints that you can find. These two swimsuits I've worn to death. This one has the wiring literally poking out of it and it stabs me, but I still wear it because I love the color so much. Same thing with this one. It's so soft. So it is definitely a good place to look and I think they're pretty affordable. Since it is from Australia, they have Australia sizing. So I do have an eight in both of these. Next up we have Paxson, which is one of my favorites for affordable swimwear. I always talk about them. I recently did a whole swimsuit haul of all their new swimsuits. So I will put a couple clips on here as I talk about them because I love their new swimwear and then I'll just show you the ones that I've had for forever. For Paxson, the sizing is a little different than I usually do so I do a small on the bottom and a medium on the top and I just think they do such a good job at having a large variety. Kind of whatever you want to find is on there and they have the prettiest colors and prints and they are always running a sale so I would say this is one of the most affordable options with a very large variety that you can find. On that same note, I recently tried on a bunch of Target swimwear in store and I will have that link below. I'll put up a couple clips now as I talk about it, but I was so impressed. I did not purchase anything simply because I do not need any more swimwear as you can see from this video. However, if I was looking for swimsuits, I would 100% buy from there. They made me feel so confident. They were so affordable, like actually affordable. I think everybody would agree on that. And their patterns were genuinely so cute. Like amazing. Honestly, I was extremely <laughs> impressed with Target. I'm going to bundle like Billabong, Roxy, all those kind of surf brands into one because most of them are owned by an overarching one company. I recently just got this Billabong swimsuit and I am in love with it, guys. Like it is so cute to me and I've owned this other Billabong one piece that I always get asked about and I feel so bad that I can't link it anymore, but I just think it's one of the best patterns to ever exist. Ever. And then I feel like their basics are just always so good. Like you can't really miss with them. I especially like these two underwire tops that I have. And I always get asked about them when I wear them. The purple one is from Billabong and the orange one is from Roxy. And I will say, just like a lot of companies, these run a little small. So I usually am wearing a medium in all those brands. I'm going to wrap all this up by kind of speeding through the brands that I don't have as many of. First up, we have Lux Swimwear, which I just got these in the mail this week. And I've already worn it to the beach because I think they're so unique and different. I'm wearing a medium in all of these. And honestly, I would say they fit a little small like I wouldn't be surprised if a large actually fit me because I would say these fit pretty snug but on me it kind of fits perfect so depending on how you're leaning this swimsuit from beginning boutique is one of my favorites because of the back it has these two ties and I just think it looks so good and this pattern is always everyone's favorite it's just so cute and I am wearing an eight in this swimsuit this swimsuit from feline swim is literally my favorite swimsuit ever and ever is an understatement because all these are my favorite swimsuit ever but I'm just obsessed with the color and the pattern of this one I have a medium and this top and bottom and I just think it's so flattering on but just overall I'm a sucker for a vibrant cute pattern and I feel like I've never seen anything like this. Bright Swimwear is an affordable option that, that I know a lot of people love and people always ask me to review. I wear a small and bright swimwear and personally I wouldn't say like oh my gosh I'm feeling this and it's like incredible quality but I feel like I love how it wears. I've worn it in the ocean. It holds up well and I just think the colors are so cute on this. So I definitely try them out if you're looking for an affordable option. This cute orange one is from Princess Polly and I literally wore this this week. I'm so obsessed with it. I know this is an older one so I don't think they have it on their site but if you go on there they have so many cute swimsuits. I have a four in this swimsuit and yeah it's pretty basic. It's super soft. Probably one of the softest materials that I found from like a big company selling swimsuit and I love this one so much. Fanatics sent me this shark one which I love. I probably don't grab it as much as I should because I love sharks but I don't really wear as you can probably tell many dark colors but I think she came out with like two patterns of kind of a shark swimwear. Not sure if she sells them anymore but these are so fun. Black bow I think makes some really cute patterns but I will say these are on the cheaper end as in quality wise. Same problem as like the lining showing. I feel like whenever I wear this 
it like turns half in half out but i have a medium in this one and it is super super soft it just doesn't really stand out to me as one of my favorites more girls is a local brand that i love their clothes oh it's so cute shop them online because it's like the perfect beachy clothes it's amazing and i have two swimsuits from them they are so fun and different i feel like the orange one kind of gives like european vibes and i feel like they're a fun option to kind of change it up from the normal routine i want to preface all this that you do not need to buy a bunch of swimsuits i started building up my whole swimsuit collection because i was buying swimsuits secondhand and that is my secret i go into depop and you can find tons of klonikini tons of triangles sometimes not always the best deals but you just kind of gotta hunt for a couple days and when one pops up snag it and i know some people find that a little gross but just wash it it's fine just wash it again you don't need like a million swimsuits so if you can find one good kalani kinis for like a good 40 60 bucks then you definitely don't need to be buying tons and tons and tons of hundred dollar swimsuits and if you want that then that's great too. But I never want to make people feel bad or like this is realistic to have so much money in swimsuits. Like I said, I get sent tons of these. And I just want to provide you with all the information in case you are wondering on which one you want to invest in, which one fits your vibe the most. And also just share my collection because I know it's so fun to be nosy and to look at other people's closets. I personally love watching these videos. And that was everything. I am doing a bunch of TikTok videos where I'm trying on different swimsuit brands like Cotton On, airy urban outfitters so stay tuned on tiktok for those videos but i thought i'd start out by just showing you what i have and my little swimsuit collection in case you are looking to invest in a swimsuit or two for the summer or for spring break subscribe for all the summer content coming because i am just so excited like this is getting me in the mood especially with this beach club t-shirt scream summer to me and also leave a comment maybe what your favorite swimsuit is and also what you're looking forward to most this summer thank you guys so much for watching